Good morning, wonderful writers! Mrs. Opfer here, and do I have an opinion story for you? It's called Duck Rabbit, and we are going to get started right now. Keep thinking in your mind, which opinion do you agree with? Duck Rabbit. It's by Amy Rosenthal. Oh, hey, look! A duck! That's not a duck. That's a rabbit. Gosh, I don't know. I can't really decide. Are you kidding me? It's totally a duck. It's for sure a rabbit. For sure. Oh, boy. It's going to be hard to choose an opinion. Oh, see? There's his bill. What are you talking about? Those are his ears, silly. It's a duck. And he's about to eat a piece of bread. Oh yeah, ducks do like to eat bread, don't they? It's a rabbit. And he's about to eat a carrot. Hmm. I've decided yet which opinion I agree. Wait, oh, wait, listen. Did you hear that? I heard duck sound. Oh, that's funny. I distinctly heard rabbit sounds. Oh, rabbits do like to sniff, don't they? Now the duck is wading through the swamp. Ooh, no. The rabbit is hiding in the grass. Hmm. I just can't decide. <gasps> there, see? It's flying. Flying? It's hopping. Oh, wow. Wonderful writers. Look how this page turns vertically. Look, the duck is so hot, he's getting a drink. No, the rabbit is so hot, he's cooling off his ears. I can kind of see it both ways. Gosh, it's going to be hard to choose an opinion for this topic. Here, look at the duck through my binoculars. Oh, you can get a closer look. Sorry, still a rabbit. <laughs> Here, ducky, ducky. Here, you cute little rabbit. Oh my gosh. If only I had some friends to help me decide, huh? Oh, great. You scared him away. I didn't scare him away. You scared him away. Hmm. You know... Maybe you were right. Maybe it was a rabbit. Oh, maybe. Oh, thing is, now I'm actually thinking it was a duck. Oh, no! Now these two characters have changed their opinions. They flip-flopped. Well, anyway, now what do you want to do? I don't know. What do you want to do? Hey, look! An anteater! That's no anteater. That's a brachiosaurus. Oh, boy. The end. Wow! Wonderful writers. What a great mentor text. Sometimes reading a story gives us wonderful inspiration for the writing we'll do. And today, we're going to share our opinions to talk and write and draw all about if we thought this character was a duck or a rabbit. I can't wait to see your writing. I had so much fun reading the story Duck Rabbit with you. Quack, sniff, sniff. Now I'm getting ready to work on my opinion writing.
Here's our question for today. Check it out. Is it a duck or a rabbit? Finish the drawing and write about your opinion. I got started already, friends, with my name, and I started with an opinion sentence starter. I think the animal is a duck because there's another good opinion word. It looks l like it as a b ill. Period at the end. And a bill is kind of like the duck's mouth. So I want to color the bill orange. Ooh, that for sure looks like a duck. Ooh, I love that. And then I'm going to start to think of another reason why I chose duck for my opinion, but I wanted to try to finish the drawing too. So I think I'm gonna just do a little sketch here of some feathers. There's his tail feathers. There's kind of his body. Oh yeah, that looks so good. And then I feel like they have webbed feet. Well, okay, those are some very silly duck feet, but that's okay. Just kind of rolling with it. <laughs> oh, that's part of the fun of artwork. It doesn't have to look any certain way. Thank goodness. <laughs> then maybe I'll color the feathers in, this kind of brownish. And I might make the feathers on the duck's face a little lighter. Ooh, now maybe he's kind of standing, or she, in some tall grass. Ooh, there was a page in the story that kind of gave me inspiration for this picture. Maybe kind of at the edge of a pond, right? Because ducks like to swim in ponds. Ooh. Very nice detail. Now, as I'm working on my picture, writers can tell stories about their opinions with pictures and words. I wanted to think of one more reason. So I have a great first reason. I think the animal is a duck because it looks like it has a bill. And I'm gonna label d uh, and I'm gonna label B -ill. Let's make the arrow a little bit longer. That's good. But I wanted to give another reason too. Just adding some little sunshine here. Cute. In the story, we heard this sound. Quack. And I feel like that helped me decide about my opinion. I think the animal is a duck because it looks like it has, it has a bill. I also heard quack, quacking sounds. in the story, period at the end. So maybe I should do a quack, ooh, speech bubble. Quack. Oh, that's so good. Nice. So writers, it's your turn to let us know if you think this awesome character from our story today was a rabbit or a duck. We can't wait to hear all about your opinions. See you soon.